16.9a compound fractions numbers compound or complex fractions are just fractions that are in fractions We clear the fractions by multiplying each term by the LCD of everything. So in our first example here, notice that we have a 4, 6, 2, and 3, so then our LCD is going to be 12. So we're going to multiply this by 12 and this by 12. Sometimes it helps to think of them as being separate. So we have 12 divided by 4, which would be 3, and 3 times 3 is 9. 12 divided by 6 is 2, and 2 times 5 is 10. 12 divided by 2 is 6, and 6 times 1 is 6. 12 divided by 3 is 4, and 4 times 4 is 16. So what we have now is 19 over a negative 10, and it's simplified. In example 2, we have a 2 and a 4 as our common denominator, or, or as our denominator, so we want our common denominator is going to be 4. So we have 4 divided by 2, which would be 2, and 2 times 1 is 2, plus 4 times 2 is 8, and then in the denominator we have 4 times 1, which would be 4, plus 4 divided by 4 would be 1, and 1 times 9 is 9. So we now have 10 all over 13, and our complex fraction or compound fraction is simplified.